Hey guys, Rocky again. So, as the title suggests, I want to you again. Specifically, the limited edition Zelda Wind Waker one. So, if you also haven't seen it, it's just a standard premium Wii U. But the gamepad has lovely. So high real logos on it. So I first picked up a Wii U at launch. I ordered one and I had it launch window and it sat and I played a bit of it and to be honest I was really disappointed in it and early in the late last year I sold it. I had a black premium launch with half dozen games and I went bye bye. Then recently I got speaking to a colleague at work about, uh, he just picked up a new 3DS and he was enjoying that and I said why don't you pick up a cheap Wii U. So this started a competition between the two of us so we were on eBay looking for cheap Wii U's. So initially we were both going for the premium, for the white basic one and a couple of games just because there was a few things I fancy playing again. So I did get one and it is sitting in the corner. It's a white basic Wii U that came with a couple of games. Now there was a slight issue with one of the, the analog sticks but I thought I could fix that just changing it in the analog sticks. However, after I bought it, a couple of weeks went by, still no Wii U. So message the seller, nothing. Opened the case, nothing. So you know, so the I think the case would end on the Friday, so about Friday morning, at 6 in the morning, closed the case, eBay found my favour, and I got my money back. Comes home on the Friday from work, and they're sitting, are not one, but two packages. One of them sent Royal Mail Parcel Force, which was the Wii U console itself, and it's literally the white console, the gamepad, and the two power bricks. No packing whatsoever. Barely sealed, sent Pass Force 48. Uh, then I got another, then the other parcel came Royal Mail, just standard second class. Basically, had the games thrown in a box and posted just wrapping around. It's like Pikmin 3, uh, another game, Skylanders, but just the, the game in the mat, just the game in the case. Swap Force, Scale and Swap Force, and a Disney Infinity Portal, very, very strange. And that was like just over £100, and so it arrived. Uh, at that point, I would have been happy, you know, I just, because I'd, I'd waited weeks and I got my money back. The console itself is in terrible condition. It looks like somebody had physically, like the back of it's all scraped and damaged here. There's a big crack about there in the white plastic, but all this is all like, like it's like scraped across the ground. More annoyingly, when it's on, it's like one of the internal speakers is like broken, it's it's like it's blown out, so it just gets fuzzy. The console itself is also extremely dirty. So I message the seller. I haven't heard anything back. I phoned eBay, spoke to a very nice chappy with the Indian American accent hybrid. Whether he's in India or America, I don't care. He told me as far as they're concerned, the case is closed, I've got my money back do what I want with the Wii U. So at the moment it's sitting in a bag with the two boxes just because it's in a state and um, the seller's also had multiple negative feedback since I bought it from him for selling stuff and not posting it. In the meantime my colleague at work got his Wii U, fair enough his was a bit late, he got a, a basic and he was playing the hell out of Whatever he got with it, I think Mario Kart was on the on the on, on the machine itself. He he just created a second account and he was playing on that. Um, he did he wanted to play Smash Brothers online, so he bought a controller and some other stuff. Then he discovered that because it's only the basic, there wasn't enough space, so he used an external hard drive. And I'm like, oh. and the time you start adding all this stuff in, you're like, oh, this is not going to be cheap. So I bid on about twenty we use on eBay. Uh, 
finally sold for paying a bit more for what because actually what I wanted was boxed, and the Zelda one is really nice. So I've got the Zelda limited edition one, as you've seen the case for there. On the hard drive, there is Zelda. There is also Monster Hunter. Not really interested in that. Got some physical games as well, though. So Darksiders Two. Batman Armored Edition, which I have owned before but never played. These are all in really nice shape, by the way. Like discs are all unmarked. I don't think things. The console itself is immaculate. It's in really nice shape. Okay, it was super friendly. Mass Effect, which I really, really love. Mass Effect, but do want to go through and play it again. Sniper Elite. And Ninja Gaiden 3. So that's what I got in the bundle. I also recently bought those a humble bundle for Nintendo. I got that. So I've got the digital copies of those games. And added to my. Because I had to create a second Nintendo ID because I'd linked the first one to my first Wii U and you can't unlink them. So I've created a different user ID, etc. etc. I also have an amiibo that I bought really cheap a while ago because I wanted to see what they were like. So I fiddled with that and it's pretty cool. More importantly, I also picked up this which is something I really want to play. I've also got another couple of bits and bobs coming that will be in a separate Probably I'm gonna do a combined May, uh, April and May pickups and packages video because I, I bought bugger all in April and I seen I bought quite a lot during May. So, so guys, yes, I'm a Wii U owner again. If you want to add me on Nintendo, whatever, um, put your user ID in the bottom below and I'll get and I'll get you added. So thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Bye bye.